This is what? What is it, you dog? Every single glitch oh. for season five. Wow. Drop a like and subscribe. Huh? Or you will die. Okay, okay, I will. My XP flowing, my weapon is glowing. I'm hiding under the map without you knowing. Just so that I can level up fast. If I don't like how I play, then kiss my ass. But the glitches, yeah, that will last forever. Soon they'll be patched and we'll have to remember. This is finally a new method where no one will be kicked for an activity by doing this. As you can see on screen, two tokens right there. And after I fast forward the next hour and a half, I've gone completely AFK. I'll have eight tokens in the bank and I usually get kick fan activity with the Rast method. And guys, this AFK method never worked for me. It worked for other people's, but never for me. But now with this new method, it works every single time. So there you go. As you can see, every single game, I'm getting over one battle pass XP token because it's double XP right now. So make sure you're doing this ASAP, guys. And go ahead, drop a like, subscribe. This is definitely the best thing to do right now because as you can see, you also get rank XP. And that's a lot of rank XP to get just for going AFK. And then weapon XP as well. 6,000 weapon XP just for going AFK. It's ridiculous. Do it right now. And let's take a quick look at my sponsor for this video, Mitch Cactus, because he offers a range of services for Modern Warfare 3, including camos, camos, and more camos for both Modern Warfare 3 and Modern Warfare 2. He's also got pre-made accounts for Modern Warfare 3, and then also zombie schematics boost. You got the nuke skin boost. Over 10,000 customer reviews. We can check out yourself. Go ahead and use code Joey for 5% off. Links in the description. And now let's get back to the video. Okay, let's go ahead and show you exactly what to do. So it's very similar to the last one, but there's one more step that you have to to do before you do your AFK method so that you can go ahead and go AFK without being kicked. And that is start a game of plunder quads and play out the entire game like you normally would without going AFK. Just play it, get some kills, get some XP, etc. Now, once that game is done, you're going to come back to the menu and from here, going to do the exact same steps. So go to the settings menu, go to controller, um, turn on parachute automatic behavior to always and then go to the weapon section and make that weapon that you want to level up while you're AFK as your primary weapon in the uh, favorite loadout. Look at that level 20 out of 21 just by going AFK. I know it's insane. And then from here guys do exactly as I show you on the controller. Put the elastic band on the trigger and then put the analog sticks uh, pointing upwards by turning the controller upside down. And that's it. Just make sure you play a full game of plunder quads before you do the AFK method. Otherwise you will be kicked. If you play a full game, I don't know why it tricks the game into thinking that you're playing. For some reason, it just works. So do it and watch it's going to work. And just to say thank you, drop a like and subscribe. I load up my gun and I'm ready to go. I got a glitch in my pocket. It's a camo show. Why stick to the map and no one knows I'm dead. To unlock this bad boy right here, guys, you're going to do the exact same thing that I just showed you to get the uh, AFK Battle Pass tokens. But do make sure you do the step that has the weapon XP when you go ahead and do it um, like this. Just make sure the weapon's in the primary slot when you're doing this afk glitch and it'll get xp for your weapon automatically which will give you weapon xp and in turn over time will get you the afk prestige cameras because to unlock those cameras all you need is literally weapon xp on your gun so slowly you go to the prestige cameras one by one afk until you get all of them and then that's it that's all you have to do to get the prestige camera in the quick afk glitch simple and easy like and subscribe my xp flowing my weapon is glowing i'm hiding under the map without you knowing just so that i can level up fast if i don't like how i play then kiss my ass but the glitches this is definitely still working for Season 5, the best XP glitch going right now that you can do solo or you can do with the squad, it doesn't matter. Alrighty, so for those of you who've never seen this before, you probably have, but I'm just going to show you some tips anyway. But if you haven't, this is going to be a mad one for you to do in zombies for the rest of the season. It never gets patched. It can't get patched because technically it's not actually a glitch. It's an exploit. And if they remove it, then the whole game will be fucked up because the way it works is you go to an exfil in either tier 1 and tier 2. You call the exfil and a lot of zombies come. But there's a trick to it to make even more zombies come and to know when to actually go to the exfil and do this exploit. So if you go to the start of the game, you'll notice you get some zombies, but not too much. But then if you want zombies, Zombies like this, like that's an insane amount right there. There's a much dramatic difference between this one and the one I just showed you. It's because of the timing, when you're supposed to do it and where you're supposed to do it. So if you've got good equipment, you go straight to tier two and you'll start off with some mad zombies. You get a lot of them there, not like tier one, where if you start off at the start of the game, not too many spawn in. But when you go to the orange zone from the get go, there's gonna be heaps of zombies spawning. Look at the difference. This is how many come in the orange zone. It's a lot more. And this is the start of the game. But there's one more trick that I'm gonna be explaining to you right now, guys. 
guys that if you go and wait to the end of the game and you wait for the entire storm to come out like this, the last X fill is going to be phenomenal. You can easily get over 10,000 XP here in just two minutes by doing this. Go to the last X fill and kill as many zombies as you can. That's it. Weapon XP is insane. Rank XP is insane. And because you're staying past the 15 minutes, you're getting extra game time. Your battle pass XP is also going to be insane. It's a triple XP exploit, I guess. And you can do this forever. For the remainder of the history of Modern Warfare 2 zombies, they'll never patch it. I'm in the game. It's Modern Warfare 2. I used to struggle, but now I'm feeling way brand new. I found a glitch. And let me tell you, man, it's giving me superpowers. I'm Superman. I'm and this is how you exactly unlock the STG and the Static HV in Modern Warfare 3 instantly without having to do anything, get it in less than 5 minutes, let's begin. So just like last season guys, we're going to be doing the exact same method to unlock the new weapon straight away. I personally use this myself and a lot of people help me out with this and they'll help you out as well. You can go ahead and check the comments of my last season's videos to see all the helpful feedback I got from my Discord. So what you're going to do is exactly that, join my Discord and there's going to be people that have the weapons unlocked already, dropping them for you in zombies so that you get it straight away unlocked. With over 7,000 members, it's a very big community. A lot of people are always online and everyone's down to play and help each other out. So go ahead, join my Discord, drop a like, subscribe, and get that new STG in Static HV. To see all the other Season 5 glitches coming out tomorrow or the day after, or maybe a past one, click on the video on screen right now.